Today I decided to go with the classic basic white tee and denim pants look. My top is from Gentle Woman. I love the rhinestones here. I've been really into bling bling stuff lately. And I also got quite a few questions on this necklace that I have been wearing a lot lately. It's a star gemstone pendant. It's so cute. Yeah, I just randomly stumbled upon this pendant when I was scrolling through my recommendation page on Taobao. So this is my basic outfit of the day. And as for my bags, I have another one here. Barabara Bara sent me a few bags recently and I thought it would be fun to do a quick little unboxing together. And I've talked about them on my channel here before. I absolutely love the quality of their bags. And I'm also partnering with them to do a giveaway for you guys, which I will talk more about in a bit. So get excited about that because I'm really excited. So Barabara Bara is a London-based brand and all of their bags are handmade with high quality leather. I love the craftsmanship of their products and also the quality of it. And I love that all of their bags have this really unique British vintage style. All right, let's start off with this little bag right here it's so cute this is Mary Mini. It's the mini version of one of the best sellers, Mary. It comes in both brown and black. And I got the black because I have the regular size Mary in brown. So I thought I should get it in a different color. This is the size comparison of them next to each other. It has the same chic design, but of course the mini version is a lot cuter. I love how structured this bag is and it just feels really high quality. The hardware and everything just feels really really well made. It has the same Barabara Bar logo in the back just like the regular size. Oh my gosh, it's raining now. I hope you guys don't mind the sound of the rain. It's so loud. I love how unique this bag looks and the brass hardware detailing is such a great touch to this bag. It has four studs at the bottom to prevent it from rubbing to the surface that you put your bag on. And even though this is a mini bag, it's pretty spacious inside as well. This is the size comparison of it to my iPhone 12 and it does fit my phone inside. Ta -da! I love when a mini bag is big enough to fit my phone because I hate carrying my phone in my hand around. So the fact that this small tiny bag fits my phone is it's a plus to me i love this bag i'm gonna be wearing this today and this is also the bag that i am giving away to three lucky winners and the giveaway is gonna be open internationally so no matter where you are you are welcome to participate in the giveaway the giveaway will end in 14 days from the date this video goes live i will be announcing the three lucky winners on my instagram stories so Good luck! Next, we have Dylan. This is a unisex crossbody bag. It has two sizes to choose from and I got the regular size. There is a mini version of this as well, but I got the regular size because I thought this would fit a lot more. And I actually got this for Tyler because he loves his Barabara Bara backpack that I got him a few months ago. He uses that backpack every day for work, so I thought I would get him a crossbody bag for more casual use. And because this is a unisex bag, it doesn't look too big on me as well. So I could also use this from time to time. And again, the brass hardware on this bag is so unique. All of their bags are lined with this really nice suede material inside. There is also another front pocket right here that you can fit your receipts or cards in here. This is a A6 size book and this fits nicely in here so this is perfect to carry around your ipad mini your notebook and all the necessities and this is a bag that i have been eyeing on from their website for a while it's a shoulder bag I've actually already used this because I just couldn't wait this is the inner shoulder bag for some reason it just reminds me of a bear 
and if you guys follow me on instagram you know that i have been obsessed with anything bear related lately so when i saw this bag i just immediately fell in love it's so cute the straps on this bag are not adjustable but it fits just nice as a shoulder bag i love the length of it and again it has a really nice brass opening so for this you have to twist it to open it's really really spacious inside yeah even though this doesn't look that big it could fit my camera in here my wallet my phone everything i need on a daily basis so i've been loving this shoulder bag lately this also comes in black as well but i just really love the shade of brown from Bera Bera. i think it has the perfect balance between the warm and cool tone i even got a brown straps for my watch too match my brown bag i will leave the links to all of these bags in my description box and don't forget to check out the giveaway on this bag on my instagram i'm back home now got my Mama Maggie me because I'm so hungry. Change into some comfy shorts and the queue at the bank was so long. I am so drained by that, which is why I didn't vlog anything. This is my late lunch for today. <laughs> This is what I'm gonna try to make today. It's so freaking cute. I'll make sure to include the link to this tutorial in my description box for you guys. This is the color that I'm gonna be using for my first gummy bear. I think it's gonna be really cute. Today is a Saturday and I kind of want to go out and spend the day unplugged. I've been spending way too much time on my phone, on my iPad. My screen time has gone out like crazy lately so I decided to get dressed up and head out. I'm gonna first go grab lunch, um, maybe go to a coffee shop or even the library to read. I know it's kind of rare coming from me because I used to never read. I get distracted really easily whenever I'm reading but recently I've picked out a few new books and I kind of enjoy reading reading these days so today we're gonna be going on a cute little book date and this is my outfit this cardigan is from B Fleurs. it's my first time wearing it out and my necklace is from Anna Luisa as well as my earrings and under my cardigan I just have on this plain white t-shirt that has this really cute bow detailing my skirt is also thrifted I just rolled down the top bending to make it a little bit shorter Walk with me <laughs> in the foreign rain. Yellow jacket on. Nothing but a smile stretched across your face. And that you play. 
I feel so <laughs> safe. Bye. With the box of snacks in your arms wrapped around my way. You look so nice and sweet to say. When he warms at your side, always seem to know what to say to me. And life looks bleak, and I can't see. Hello everyone, right now it is almost 4.30pm I've just been editing all day but I'm finally done with work now I have a video scheduled upload today so I'm free for the rest of my day I'm just gonna continue with my gummy bear crochet I'm done with making all the parts now so I just have to stitch it all up and we're done Oh my gosh, the weather today is so hot. I have been working on this video for so long because there are so many shots that I need to retake but I'm so happy with how it turns out and I'm kind of nervous uploading this video to be honest because it's my first time making a video related to my skincare routine so it's kind of different than my usual type of content but I don't know, I'm kind of happy to step out of my comfort zone to upload something different but I'm also nervous about the outcome but about my outfit since this is a OOTD vlog I don't even know if this outfit is worth documenting but I'm wearing something really comfy this is my at home outfit this is what I like to wear at home just a big t-shirt with my pajama shorts this pajama shorts is actually from Lovito and it was really really affordable as well but it's so comfy I've been wearing it to sleep almost every day like every other day now and I decided to put on this necklace today because I haven't worn it in a while and I like to have this part in front because there's this cute little swan pendant here I have my panda plushie here and I'm just gonna be using a part of this panda to stuff my gummy bear I'm just stuffing it to the head I'm planning to make a few more of this to kind of have them in different colors I think that's gonna be really cute and I'm thinking of giving them to my friends this Halloween but I don't know if I can make it in time because Halloween is so soon so I might do it for Christmas instead I don't know um, I hope they're not watching this I hope this doesn't spoil the surprise almost done with my gummy bear but I'm trying to fix the head shape because it looks a bit weird and I also made another one in blue so this is what it's supposed to look like but eh, actually doesn't look that bad so I made a pair and I'm also planning to make a bunch more but now I'm just gonna take a break from crocheting because I got some sandwiches hash brown chicken sliced toast and this is hash brown chicken. Hey, you got the same thing as me. Mm -hmm. oh, I got sandwich. It looks so good. I found my almost packing a little bit yesterday just to knock some stuff out of the way. Um, This is what I decided to wear for the night. I'm wearing my Merry Mini. And I also have on my cute little gummy bear as a back charm. They look so cute together. And I'm also bringing a blazer with me just in case it gets cold in the cinema. And this blazer is from Simple Retro. And for my necklace, I'm just wearing this gold necklace with a green gem. This is from Anna Luisa. You have me wrapped around your finger And I can't seem to leave Baby, let me breathe Please don't be naive You got me staying a little longer Oh, you 
from the movies and I just washed up and everything I have my retainers in which is why I'm talking weird yeah Black Adam was actually pretty good we kind of had low expectation going in because of all the bad reviews online but it was actually pretty good like I would rate it 7 out of 10 the plot twist was also really good I don't understand why there were so many bad reviews online but yeah it's been so long since I last went to the movies so I had a lot of fun. Yeah, I'm gonna go to bed now because it's currently 1 a.m. Good night. <laughs>